songs cause I love her Then played some shows in the suburbs It was the middle of summer in Texas The band that you guys have come to know and love We got Secret Handshake So you are, So you're on tour right now with the Rocket Summer We did a couple dates on a warp tour Is uh, touring where you're down this year? Uh, is it, is it, what is it? Is it wearing it down? Uh, no, no, not so much. I mean, it's, it's good to do, and uh, this is kind of the last tour for us of the year, and then we're going to do uh, a new record. So it's good, kind of, you know, we've been on tour most of the year, so it'll be good. Okay, I've heard a speculation on the title. Can you, like, say what it is, or um, hold it out? Yeah, like, I don't, I don't really know. Like, I thought, like, I, like when I made it, like, it's kind of really weird. Like, I, I wrote this whole record, I wrote it like a year ago. Sat with the record again, maybe like four or five months ago. I was like, I don't think I like it anymore. And so I kind of got rid of eight of the songs and I rewrote all these other songs. I don't know, it's, like, it's almost like it's like I wanted, like I wrote this record and I was like, this is great. And then, like a couple months later, I was like, I don't like this anymore. I'm going to redo it. So it kind of did. I don't know, I don't know what's going to call me more. Oh, okay. Because, yeah, that's the speculation right now is it's called I Am the Truth. Okay, you, you teamed up uh, to write Love on uh, Arms this year with one of your t-shirts. Like, how did that, how did you guys come up to team up with them? Um, we were on tour uh, in England, and uh, they were on the tour, so it was, uh, they were like speaking before each of the shows. He was, it was a guy, it's kind of Jamie, he was speaking before each of the shows. And, and um, it was really cool, and you could see that people really cared. It was really positive, and, and then I, I'd never met him before, so I was like, you know, we were on yeah. tour together, so we just started hanging out. Was like, this is really cool. I don't know, just, you know, definitely, like, it's, uh, it's, it's a cool organization. He's cool, so, you know, it's like, that's a great, sure. You guys, of course, log on to myspace.com slash the secret handshake, and you can purchase a t-shirt, and 50% of the proceeds go to him. Um, and you did a mixtape this year that was for free. Yeah. <laughs> like, I know, like, downloading's, like, a bad thing now, especially illegally, and it was, it was cool, because it was, like, old-school hip-hop tape, it was one track. Yeah. And is, are you ever going to take that down, or is it going to be... Yeah, it's, it was one of those things we just I just want to give away, you know, it's like, I, because all my music is, like, I make it all on like a laptop, it doesn't take me that long, like, compared to, like, a band, you know, like, yeah. band practice, and then you have to go record it and make sure it sounds great. It's more like, I sit there and I can make some beats and kind of sing and sing for it, you know, it sounds good or it doesn't, but I have all these kind of extra songs, and I feel like, you know, here's all these kind of songs that I have, probably aren't good enough to be on like, an actual record, so we just put them all together and give it away. Yeah. You know, it's definitely something cool for people. I thought, I thought it was great, so I, mean, I was excited that people liked it. I was like, oh, this is cool. I know, I downloaded it, right? of course I didn't read, so I thought it was like four or five tracks, uh -huh. and right. it was one. So that was really cool that you had to listen to for like 23 minutes. Yeah, yeah, it was really, it was cool. It was a, it was a bunch of songs. It was fun, it was fun to make. And uh, the Christmas song. Oh, okay. Will that, will, that ever, will that ever resurface again? Because um, I don't know if it'll ever be like officially released. Or yeah. I don't. I don't really think it's that good. But well, um, sometimes it jam out too. Like no one comes up with Christmas songs. But, but I think I'll probably like, make another one this year. And, uh, I'll see. You know. So. Okay. And you did a, a Skilo cover for Punk Goes Crunk. Yeah. Yeah. Like a lot of people pick modern stuff, and you went back a couple of years. Man, I tried to go. I tried to go really far back. I was trying to do like. Like the, the EP, the summer EP, 
and you had stuff before that, and yeah. of course your fans are hardcore and they want it. What would you say to those fans? Because it is posted on the internet, like on sites yeah. you can download illegally. No, I mean it's you know I mean, it's fine because I think that like you know you become like commonplace for most down music so things like it's like if you like the artist you know come to the show you know enjoy it if you like the artist a lot come to the show my teacher if you love the artist and you believe in everything the artist puts out by the record you know you might rip it once and put it on your iPhone but by the record I, I still like Kanye West records I buy like Ben Folds records you know what I mean it's like these artists that, like I think. Like whatever jams that I like, it might not necessarily be like like I don't kind of want to need my money, but I like his records a lot. <laughs> well, I still like going to the records and buying uh, CDs. And what was cool about yours is when you had to, when you bought the one full year, you had to look, you had to actually buy it to see what the songs were called. Right, right. So was did you come up with that, or was that like the label, or uh, it was uh, we did the layout of the CD, we forgot to put the track titles on the inside, <laughs> so it was a mistake. <laughs> People thought it was cool. Huh? So, I thought it was cool because yeah. I, I didn't know how many songs were on. I was like, I just wrote a couple of songs on. I was like, wow, more than I thought because I bought the EP. Yeah. And I was like, just more than seven, please. Yeah. No, no, no. So, um, is there a tentative date for the record at all? Or just it's going to be out? like, it's going to be late March, early April. Um, the single, like, on iTunes will come out in January. The first thing for the record is a song with Saturday. Jesse's girl kind of vibe, you know what I mean? It's really the whole record's really like '90s inspired, like, like songs about like you know like being a kid, like riding bikes, like watching Family Matters, like hanging out, you know what I mean? It's about yeah. like, just like nerdy dumb stuff you did as a kid, growing up in the '90s, which I '90s kids so, like, did comic books, man. That's yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's seriously, it's like it's a record about like not taking anything too seriously. It's just about like about feeling good and just like, I don't, I don't know, I don't know, it's might like, sound really cheesy, but it's definitely about like, it's really 90s inspired, and just rocks like a 90s song. Yeah, that's cool. And um, you're always appreciative of your fans. I know like a lot of people were still, because you did a contest back, I think it was this year or last year, that when people bought merch, you gave them like, they were entered in a con oh, contest. In December, yeah, yeah. We did this thing called the uh, My Favorite Things Contest. We're going to do it again this year. We gave away like so much stuff. We gave away like like hoodies, like, and, like new, like not like my stuff, but like hoodies, like my favorite combo, my favorite, you know, my favorite movies, my favorite like all kinds of stuff. I know. We gave away like cheesecake factory gift cards. Like it was like funny. It was, it was cool. cool. It was cool because like you know we like did it and it was great because it was like people could like and it was cool. It was all this and we could kind of see whatever like I was into. Yeah. So it'll be interesting like, this year to try to like outdo ourselves. You know, maybe like give away like a skateboard. You know what I mean or something. You know something something cool. I just thought it was cool that you gave out the Watchmen comic book. Yeah. Because that was last year, and I was like, dude, ain't no one know about that. Yeah, oh. now there's a movie. I know. And they're trying to delay it. Why? I heard about that. Geeks need to see that movie. Yeah. Well, anyway, be sure you guys check out The Secret Handshake on MySpace, secrethandshake.com, or it's .net, probably. It's the secrethandshake.net, yeah. Yes. And, uh, of course, go to the shows, because I even dance, and I'm a big guy. I feel that. I love her Then played some shows in the suburbs It was the middle of summer